Hello children. I'm back again, as you knew I would be. I'm here today to talk to you about public spaces. Sometimes spaces are closed off to us. Sometimes we cannot go where we think we should. When was the last time you went for a walk? And I mean, not like the constitutional, oh, I have to go out and get some air. When was the last time you really went for a walk, went into the woods and saw exactly what was going on? Weeks ago? Months? And I'll, I'll, I'll explain to you the reason behind this. People will try and take space from you because they understand to control your space is to control your direction within the world. When was the last time you took a walk on somebody else's property? When was the last time you trespassed? Were you stealing his heir? Were you stuffing your pockets with all the leaves that you could find? Were you physically cramming your pockets full of every single leaf you found on the ground? No. You breathed in their air, and that's enough. You realised then it was not just about the act, it's about the consumption in so doing. Reach out. Imagine it's a walk. Reach out. Take it. I've taken to eating these worms. Eating these worms. One a day. Just one. Not even one a day sometimes. But I imagine that inside these worms is a light. And soon, in taking that light into myself, I will become stronger, more powerful. That is the truth up there. Look up at the sky. And you will see that soon it will... A light like this will soon be snuffed out and made part of a newer, brighter light. But we think we are the brightest light possible. We think there can be none bigger, there can be none brighter. Well, what's behind there, we do not comprehend enough to fear. So, in being prepared, I will do what needs to be done. If you will join me in doing what needs to be done, we can make this world better. We can make it stronger. We can make it more prepared when this finally does happen. 